Shaz Chowdhury, Pep Talk UK, joined by a young man who's doing more kick-ups than I can. It's Master Shy Sheer. Shy, stop showing off. How you doing, young man? You all right? Yeah, feeling good. Feeling good, Shy. We're standing in Wantford in your back garden. You've been showing me all these skills. <laughs> Do you want a kickoff challenge with me? Uh, we have to really think about that. You have to think about that. I've been watching you. You've been doing lots of little skills for me. You did the shy one. Tell me what the shy one is. Go and get your ball and do the shy one quickly. Come back to me, come back to me. Shy, how old are you? I am nine years old. You're nine years old? Yeah. And what football club are you playing for? I play for Crystal Palace um, Academy. You play for Crystal Palace Academy? They've signed you up. Do you play for your school team as well? Uh, no, I don't play for the school team. You don't play for the school team? What's your training routine like on a daily basis? Uh, um, daily basis, so six days, six days a week. And probably we have a rest on Sunday or Monday, but in in the day I train I train three times a day. Are you a Crystal Palace fan? No, I'm a West Ham fan. Come on, you right. <laughs> No, shy, shy. You know who I support? Who? Leeds. Say it louder. Leeds. Yeah. Listen. What do I have to do to get you to come and sign for Leeds? We could do with like a good little footballer like you joining our ranks. What do you reckon? Ask your dad. What did your dad say? The best team in the world leads in the dad, 70s. Who's best team in the world? What's that? West Ham. Oh, no, no. I was liking you up until that point. Shai, what position do you play? I play left wing, right wing, left back, right back. Anyway, except for goal. Anyway, except for goal. Um, and who's your best and favourite footballer? My best favourite footballer is Lionel Messi. Um, everyone probably said Messi or Ronaldo, but I, in a part of Messi is Luka Modric. He's always on the pitch, he's always moving, passing, scoring, he's doing everything to help the team. And at West Ham, who's your favourite player at West Ham? West Ham, um, Yarmolenko. Cool, and at Crystal Palace? At Crystal Palace, um, Wilfred Zaha. Oh, everyone loves Zaha, isn't he? The guy's just got skill for days. Um, a friend of mine... Boxing coach Tunde Ajayi, mm -hmm. who coached uh, a brilliant young man called Anthony Yard. His son's at Crystal Palace as well. Josh Ajayi, keep an eye out for him. He's supposed to be another one like you, a talented young man. Yeah. Now, um, have you got any any messages for the people watching this? Um, for the people watching this who are Asian or not even Asian, just keep on working hard for who you are and just keep on pushing and pushing. If, uh, just to make your dreams come true. If you're a footballer, boxer, rugby player, keep on getting those tackles in. Um, cricketer, any, anything. Just keep on working hard and just make your family proud and make everyone proud. Do you know what? For a young, young lad, that's very inspirational. Thank you. I've taken something away from this. Um, if people want to follow the journey, how do they do it? Social media handles? Um, social media handles, my handle is shy underscore 10 underscore share, go follow it and my dad runs the account. And um, and is there anyone you want to say a thank you to? Thank you to my five coaches, the first one David Marriott, second one Terry Bobby, third one Dukesy Coaching, fourth and fourth one Jack from JJ Leap. And Rudy from our Singing Seven. And I'm sure you want to give a shout out to two very special people that have made two today happen. Very special people. My mum, who keeps on um, making me food. Lovely food, by the way. Not the samosas, though. Stay off the samosas. <laughs> and my dad, who uh, went 300 days over his mileage in his car. <laughs> so he's been we're training. Training with me, he's been working on my areas, taking me everywhere, 
North London, West London, South London, everywhere basically in England. So yeah, thank you mum and dad for all your work. Well Shai, we're going to be following the journey. Um, we hope you get that. What number do you want on the back of your shirt when you get a chance, finally at the end of it, when you're a Premier League footballer? Ten. You want to be a number 10, Shy 10. We're going to be keeping an eye out for you. Thank you from everyone at Pep Talk for giving us the opportunity to come and interview you. Keep working hard. Keep listening to your parents. Keep listening to your coaches. And may you hit the Messi-esque heights of the footballing game. Thank you, buddy. You're going to sign off with a little goal for me. And there you go, Shy's going through. Oh, and it's in. Cheers, Shy. Thank you. Oi, I didn't see a celebration, though. <laughs> Thank you, Shy. Thank you.